Hey friends, no, I haven't switched over to the babysitting channel. This is actually the DM's craft. But I wanted to show you a, a craft based on babies, and I got these little baby carts at the craft store. They're little uh, baby carriages. And I thought these would be great for converting to um, carts uh, on our tabletop games. Now I did see this on the uh, DM's craft forum, and I thought it was a great idea, and I did kind of did my take on it. So let's open this package and hit the table and start making these into usable carts for our games. Hey guys, so here's my party favor, the little uh, basket here. And I'm going to take the top cover off. I'll just pop That just pops right off. And I'm going to take the handle and switch it around like that. Okay. So now I'm going to put glue that in place with my E6000. And this works great on projects like this. It really works on this kind of plastic stuff. Uh, all kinds of uh, interesting materials. So let's glue that upside down. Then we're going to put some more glue on the handle here because I'm going to put a seat. And I have this rectangular wood piece, but you could use craft sticks or anything like that. So I'm just going to get it level and let it dry up. Cool. Now I'm going to cover up those holes with my glue gun. Just kind of squirt a little glue in the hole and blend it into the cart, the weavings of the cart. So it kind of blends in and matches. All right, sweet. Now I'm going to use these tapered craft sticks uh, with my white glue because I want to have enough time to work with them. Uh, get them the right angle uh, on the cart. So if I use the, the hot glue, it would be a little harder. So I was just going to use the white glue to get them right. Just hold it for a few seconds and it'll be good. All right, sweet. Now I'm going to use this uh, piece of cardstock and it's going to be kind of the harness for the horse. So I'll just kind of bend it uh, around in a, in a loop so it kind of goes over the two bars there and then uh, over the horse. I'll just cut off the excess. And I've got a little bit of extra on the ends there because I'm going to wrap it around the bar, right? I'm going to go under the bar. Okay, cool. So once I get that set, I'll just cut it off, glue it up. All right. Now I'm going to kind of strengthen this uh, loop up a bit, or the harness up a bit with some white glue. Just use my brush, paint it on. A little bit of water to help spread it out. Cool. Really shaping up into a wagon here. All right, now I'm going to use some uh, goop. This is actually real goop, not E6000. Uh, but I got these little rhinestones. I'm going to use these as um, bolts to hold on the harness. So I'll just kind of put them on where the cardstock meets the uh, bar there. And that'll give a nice illusion that they're bolted on, that the harness is bolted on. There we go, nice. Okay, now it's paint time. So I black bombed it with uh, flat black spray paint. And I'm going to use a, uh, a a lighter kind of wood brown, and I'm just going to kind of dry brush because I really want all that nice detail that I've got on the card itself. Okay, so let's paint it all up because it kind of has almost like a woven wood texture on it, which is really nice. And I do my uh, little planks on the seat, just paint uh, separate planks with the brush there, paint underneath the same underneath, just kind of simulate the planks. All right, now I'm going to use a lighter brown and kind of highlight some of those uh, that wood. So I'll go along some edges and along some planks. The exterior. Really start to pick out that detail. That little extra level of color uh, difference really, really adds to a piece. All right, looking really good. Really happy. All right, sweet. Now I'm going to use a little bit of a lighter, kind of a, a leathery brown for the harness. So then we'll be done, and I'll show it to you at the table. Nice. Here we have our little cart coming down the road, and we have a uh, good old uh, Roderick on there. Uh, take him off for a sec. And then we got the uh, horse. This is a tube horse. I love these horses. These are great uh, for these carts and wagons. Uh, and I had a little bit of uh, crates in the back, so we'll just take those out and take a look at it. I really like the detail on this. The wheels actually turn. That's really fun. Just a really quick, easy project for a little cart. 
and uh, it actually fits uh, two miniatures in the back. So that's even even uh, a nice little bonus there. So there you go. Uh, great little cart you can make easily and cheaply. Hey, Crafter, I hope you really enjoyed the video. If you did, give your DM Scotty a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. And uh, you can find me on Facebook. Uh, we got a great group on there, lots of uh, projects. Also, if you like the vid, why not drop a dollar in the chip jar? You can just click on the video and uh, tip the, directly to DM Scotty. And if you want to participate further, you can join Patreon and get uh, the Crafters Larry Month. It's a magazine I produce for my uh, Patreon friends. And I want to say, uh, last but not least, Go forth and craft. Yeah. Have fun crafting, guys. Scotty's little Roderick loves shortening, shortening. Scotty's little Roderick loves shortening bread. Oh, geez, Scotty, you've really sunk to a new low with this one. Get me out of here. Mini abuse, mini abuse. <laughs>